Hi, I'm Mike Boren, CTO of Beck Technology. What does make the world a better place mean to me? So Beck Technology's vision is to make the world a better place to live. And what that means to me is, is we believe that the built environment has the highest impact on the standard of living for people, period. And that means access to running water and solid infrastructure. That means uh, great schools. That means good hospitals. That means parks to play in. Uh, so all of those things that really comprise the built environment, great roads, um, have that we believe the highest impact on the quality of life for people. And overall, if you can picture in a future where that gets better and better and better and access to those facilities gets better and better and better and the quality of those facilities get better, that's what making the world a better place to live looks like for me. For Bechtech's future, I want us to make an impact. I want us to make a true difference in pre-construction. So for us in the industry that we serve, you know, that's the contractors, that's the designers, that's the, all the builders, all the people who are out there every day creating these things to make this world a better place to live. And for Beck Technology, we want to be able to have an impact on their lives as well. You know, so some things that we often use as measurables for success are can we get the estimator home earlier to spend more time with their family? Um, can we enable the pre-construction team to deliver a building cheaper than they've ever done it before because they were able to make better decisions earlier in the design process or the build process? Uh, can we make it safer? Can we make the quality of the building higher because they were able to make really good decisions and they were able to use the money that they had in the best way that was possible? Um, you know, those are, those are things that I think in Beck Technology we want to be able to see in the future. I hope that our clients look back on the relationship they've had with Beck Technology and our team and think about the impact that we've had, not only on their process and about their ability to deliver the things they need to deliver, but frankly about just the experience and the culture. Um, you know, we really do care a lot about the people in our industry. We really want to help them and we want to make a difference. And one of the things that I would love to see is I would love to see our customers coming back and realizing that just by the virtue of working with our teams, it has changed their team for the better. And they start to care more about what they do and their impact on not only internally their organization, but their impact on the planet. I think um, you know one of the things that really makes a great partnership is when you have good cultural alignment. And um, you know that's not always the case with every customer. You can't have perfect cultural alignment everywhere, but I do think we have a great culture. And I would love for our customers to one day look back and think, you know, our team culture got better as a result of working with companies like Backtech. So I guess getting into the weeds, so getting in the weeds on technology, there are some things that I think are truly exciting about what we plan to do and what is just frankly needed in this world today. And for us and our focus, it's a shift away from point solutions and it's a focus more on an entire ecosystem. Uh, and that ecosystem doesn't have to necessarily all be within our technology. It could be through partner companies and other technologies that we like to integrate with. But it is something that sews together all of the things that the pre-construction team needs to do. And the thing that I probably geek out about the most is that we think there's a huge opportunity to have computers kind of leverage and augment the human's capability because a lot of the stuff that we have to do is very um, you know kind of monotonous or very it's a very heavy lift a lot of counting and crunching of numbers and analyzing of data it's things that computers do really well but some of the things that computers don't do very well are what the pre-construction team really can shine at if just given a lot more of the opportunity and that's really to have those kind of like decision-making conversations with the customers and the owners about what truly makes a good building and how you truly can spend money and what it really means in the end. And I think there's an opportunity for us to, this is getting a little bit of the weeds and a little bit of the tech, but I think there's a huge opportunity for us to get into the space that is sort of like generative design, uh, but for estimates and for data. Uh, you see it all the time in predictive analytics on a small scale, 
We think there's a much, much bigger opportunity there uh, in a world that's called multidisciplinary design optimization. And we think that you can basically use very large scale computing to crunch away and solve tons of problems and then present information back to the estimating and pre-construction team in real time as they're making decisions to enable them to make really great decisions and provide massive amounts of value to the customers, which we think if we can get there, would truly be one of the best possible chances we have of making this world the best place to live possible.